It's gym time. Oh, he's a mess. Frank, good morning. Good morning. It's 6 a.m. in the morning. I look like crap because I just woke up. So, I want to make some coffee. Um, just basically to kind of get myself going. But, I'm gonna take you today for my whole day, I guess, so y'all can see what I do on a day-to-day -day basis because I know people ask me all the time. They get curious and stuff. So, if you guys want to see what I do on a day-to-day, -day, how I work out, how I organize everything, I guess, then keep on watching. I actually do kind of like meditate and just kind of like wake up before I go to the gym because I I had done this so many times back in the day. I would just wake up and just immediately go to the gym and it would not really do me good. And a lot of the times I would just actually kind of hurt myself because I want to let my body kind of like settle. So I will learn to listen to my body a lot more. And I also started doing meditation this year, which has helped me out a lot with mindfulness has helped me out a lot with mindfulness, also with being grateful and just in general, just goal setting because I feel like meditating is just a different one of praying, kind of. Whenever I meditate, I feel that I can just sit down and write down my goals a lot better without feeling like I'm just kind of pulling whatever kind of goal out of my ass. And the goals that I actually write down after meditating, they're actually more precise, they're more concise and they're in general just more helpful for me, so. So I am basically on my way right now to the gym. As you can tell, I got lashes, I'm like all prepared and stuff. And I am just gonna be working out first of all, of course, and I'm gonna be training my client. After that, I'm gonna be doing some groceries, just record some videos, content, and things that I gotta do for um, some other companies. Yeah, um, I'm having a hard time <laughs> staying awake, not gonna lie. So I'm just gonna try to do a warm up real quick and then basically just move forward into my workout because it's like they. I've been getting sick, so I don't really have a lot of energy either. So whatever, it is what it is. I'm gonna just do my shit. Bye. Yeah, see you guys. Not a lot of people. I was like one of the few people in the gym, which is good. I like this. Um, so pretty much, I'm about to just take my CBD because I usually do this for after my training. CBD gummies, sugar and cash. That's my go-to because they're just easy to just take around with you, and they have like enough CBD. Like I feel they just give me like just enough so I don't feel too sluggish I feel like I'm relaxed I feel like I'm getting some nice recovery I guess mm, yeah it just tastes good it has no calories zero calories no sugar or nothing so yeah I know somebody's gonna come through the way any second 
Oh my god, I look stupid. Like, I'm gonna go during my time. I just do groceries. And then, yeah, I'm just pretty much just do whatever I gotta do today. Um, <clears throat> here I am. I got all of my goodies. They're all right here on the table. I'm just gonna save them. Uh, I guess I'm just gonna show you a little bit what I got. So you have an idea of what I eat throughout the week. For protein, I do change my protein from time to time. Personally, I love to have shrimp. I just buy frozen shrimp because it's cheaper that way. Same goes for um, fish. I like to get frozen fish. i usually not a big fan of salmon, but if I feel like it's risky, I might just get like a fresh raw salmon to be honest and cook them out in a different way. I also have some clams because clams are really, really cheap, affordable, and they're also just high in protein. So whenever I'm lacking on protein, I'm gonna just boil some of these and you know, just bump up the protein intake. Smoked salmon because even though I'm not a big fan of fresh salmon, I do like to make some avocado toast with salmon, some eggs and cream cheese. I got this um, ganja fried beef steaks from my boyfriend because he loves these. Got some peanut butter because in this household we love peanut butter. I also got some frozen corn because these are a nice carb source. So whenever I'm not feeling like eating potatoes, rice or something like that, I can easily just have two of these and you know, it will be pretty much the same as rice. And it actually tastes better in my opinion. Got some rosary, seasoned chicken breasts. These are like chicken slices. Pretty good for um, sandwiches and also for my eggs in the morning. These actually mainly for my dog food because I do give them some green beans. But whenever I don't feel like cooking my own veggies, I simply just eat these. I mean, they're pretty good. Not everything that is canned is actually bad. And a lot of the times it's actually cheaper. I also got some uh, chickpeas or garbanzo because I also like to change this for my rice. So whenever I don't feel like eating rice, I usually mix this with my chicken or even my beef. Got some tuna. Tuna, it's also pretty cheap and it also has a lot of protein in it. And it's as well low in calorie. If you're looking for like a cheap protein source, tuna and clams are really good options. Over here, I got some beef, some extra lean ground beef, to be exact, 96% lean because I don't like to have any kind of fat on this. Yes, it can be a little more expensive, but if I feel like eating beef sometimes, I might just go for this. I also got some chicken thighs because I'm getting bored of your typical chicken breast. Chicken thighs, it's a little bit higher in fat. It does have more calories, but it's still good in protein. It's pretty tasty. You can just make so much stuff with this to be honest and prosciutto because i'm a big fan of prosciutto and i like to just eat it by itself as a protein uh, as a protein source um i got some raisin bran with bananas because why not we to be here i got you got some frozen beef fajitas i love this brand specifically the john souls food it tastes pretty good it seasoned amazingly to be honest it's let it down you don't want to cook you can simply just put this in the microwave for like uh, no, two minutes and boom, you already have fajitas. Move on with my day, I guess, because mm, I'll eat right after this, I guess, I don't know. Which one? Says KJ. Say hi. <laughs> Me and my uh, hot pockets, but I have a vacuum cleaner. I think I'm gonna get one of the street taco bowls because they're pretty good. It's frozen. They're also nice. To the microwave. Two minutes. Squatter. Squatter. There you go. There you go. Here's the meal. He's gonna show me. He's really sad, maybe. The guilty. 
Guys. What? Such a sad movie. It's good. I hate it. I I love I like it, but I hate it at the same time. You know what I mean? <sighs> so yeah, I'm just gonna cry. <laughs> Watch this movie at the same time. Eat at the same time, I guess. Whatever. Let's go. I don't know. Nice. Looks sweaty. Hmm? Looks sweaty. Lamb sweaty. Mm. I'm gonna try to do um protein ice pops. So yeah. One scoop of these, it's roughly, um, what's it called? 90 calories and 20 grams of protein. 90, 90 calories? 90 calories. Oh, I'm saying 90. No, 90. Get out of my way. Get out of my way. Uh, he's using my mixer. He's a uh, electric mixer. Ooh, powerful. It's like a, uh -huh. anyway, use this. And try like mix everything. Mm, powerful. It's powerful. That's all I said. I'm gonna add some cotton, cotton candy CBD in this because it adds a nice flavor and also it's like the recovery factor of this. And I'm just going to just freeze this. Hey, we could come back down to forty six thousand to be honest. Yeah. To be honest, I think we. I think it's gonna be one more leg, leg up. Uh, you see, I'm gonna pour this inside and just freeze this. So yeah, uh, make sure I don't make a mess. What do you want? Do you think you're gonna get anything? No. <laughs> Uh, if you guys uh, want to try out any CBD products, you can go ahead and try out Sugar and Cash products. They have CBD oils, gummies, and also skincare. And also, you can use my code SETUP20. That can help you save some money on the checkout. So, um, I guess I'm just going to wait up until this gets a little bit defrosted and then you show you the final result. So, I'm back. Of course, I have my makeup done because I have to go and do a live stream at 8 p.m. I know I don't say this often on Instagram because I like to keep my life private, I guess. But I do actually do Amazon live streams. And I mean, there's nothing like private about that actually. It's actually quite public. I just don't really like share that often on Instagram. But I guess if you guys do want to check out my Amazon lives, you can actually just go down below in the description. Just click right there. Check out my Amazon channel. I basically review items and stuff and just go live like four times a week. So yeah, if you want to go ahead and join me, talk to me, I guess, you can do that. But, right easily, I mean, that should got a little bit too defrosted because I took my time to do my makeup, as you can tell. But, mm -hmm. very nice, very fashion. The cotton candy and the ice appear is a really nice combination. I definitely gonna continue doing this throughout my cuts because I am trying to lose 15 pounds by the end of the year. That's my goal. If you ask me why, there's not really a specific reason why. I just feel like it. I just want to get more rep. I'm just going to finish this. I'm going to set up my live stream and just finish my day with all this. Yeah. There you go. That's basically what I do throughout the day. I mean, of course, my routine does change from time to time, from day to day, because it is really never the same, but it's kind of like that. But yeah, um, I don't know, guys, if you have any questions, you want to learn how to organize yourself, I can make more videos regarding that, how to take notes, how to meditate, all that kind of stuff. Um, yep. Thank you, guys. Love you. Hope you have an amazing day, weekend, month, year. And I'll see you on the next one. Also, make sure to subscribe because I'm watching you and I already know who you are. And if you don't subscribe to me, then I'm gonna just hunt you down. And